Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving deep into the brand new Nethunter 2024.3 update. This update brings some exciting new features that will enhance your penetration testing experience. So, whether you're a seasoned security pro or just starting out, this video is for you. Alright, let's jump right into the good stuff. Nethunter 2024.3 introduces three key features. Modular driver, this is a game changer. Say goodbye to manually flashing drivers for specific hardware. With Nethunter 2024.3, you can now load drivers directly as modules within the app. This is especially useful for devices with missing or incompatible drivers. However, it's important to note that this feature is still in alpha stage, so proceed with caution and be prepared for potential bugs. Direct Kernel Flashing Ever wished you could flash a custom kernel straight from your Android device? Well, now you can. Nethunter 2024.3 boasts a built-in kernel flashing feature. While it's incredibly convenient, there's a catch. Compatibility is currently unknown. Before flashing, make sure your device is listed as supported to avoid any complications. Remember the frustrating WPS ping crash in the 2024.2 build, its history. The developers have squashed that bug, allowing you to connect to WPS-enabled networks seamlessly. Nethunter 2024.3 is a significant update that empowers users with more control and flexibility. The modular driver loading and direct kernel flashing are powerful tools for advanced users. Remember to exercise caution with alpha features and always research before flashing kernels. If you're a Nethunter user, we highly recommend checking out this update. Just remember to proceed with caution, especially when dealing with alpha features and custom kernels. As always, leave a comment below if you have any questions, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more awesome security content.